so uh, now not high pass opacity but uh, high pass uh, so what we do now now we will sharpen our our picture so it's the last step after all retouching that we did uh, we take a last step and uh, and we try to uh, sharpen uh, what we have so we just copied um, last layer that was on the top it was 100% opacity so it's it's uh, our picture actually uh, so we don't have to uh, copy picture itself we have a uh, proportions uh, copy so it was the last last one and uh, uh, we rename this uh, to uh, high opposite uh, high uh, high pass okay so what we will do here we will go to filter with the top one and uh, we go to filter order and high pass and we don't go too high with this we just go until we we get the shape of uh, uh, or skin uh, details as you can see it's usually on about there some people use this technique before they retouch skin and uh, now uh, to hard light and what we end up with it's a uh, it's a picture that uh, looks like that and before it looked like this it's much sharper there's more details uh, in the skin uh, because they were all kept before So it's a it's a one way of of having of sharpening the picture. I'm not really a great fan uh, of this uh, because I think that uh, overall it's not uh, the best way with this method that we have. Let's try. Uh, the old school way. Uh, let's duplicate layer that we had. Let's uh, switch off the, the high pass, and uh, let's call this a uh, sharpening. So with the high pass, we we did a high pass filter, and then we we change uh, blending mode into uh, into uh, uh, hard light. With the sharpening, what we do, we just go to filter, uh, and we go to sharpen and unsharp mask. Let's control plus so we can see the skin uh, and the details, especially of the eyes. Uh, here we go. Uh, not we are not so gentle as we we are with the with the previous one. As you can see, the uh, details it's uh, less invasive. Uh, so in this type of of, of uh, retouching, that is not very. It's not high end, but it uh, you want to get a good result. Uh, I would advise you uh, to go with uh, with sharpening. So before, after, uh, before, after, compared to what we have here. High pass looks uh, much uh, sharp. Uh, sorry, high pass looks uh, sharper. So if we want to go sharper with your picture, you just go to uh, filter and um, sharpen and unsharp mask and you add extra sharpening. But remember, it's easy to over sharpen your picture and uh, it doesn't look uh, very interesting when you over sharpen this. So that's uh, what I did just now. I overcook it just a bit so uh, let's uh, go to history and uh, unsharp mask it was just one step too far ok 
okay and uh, let's go to filter and uh, sharpen because I went just too far with this okay um, so we have that so this is uh, sharpening and this is high pass sharpening and the high pass it's completely up to you which way you you prefer and uh, whatever you you want to choose and uh, how you want to sharpen uh, there's one more way uh, but it's more advanced and uh, in this part I, I will skip it uh, to see to show you those two so let's go with the sharpening and uh, so this is our picture and uh, it's and I think it's done let's see how we started with and final step okay let's duplicate uh, background and just let's drag it on the top of a, of a frame so we can preview uh, how much we changed and we got uh, from the picture that was taken like that to the picture that looks like this thank you for watching and if you have any questions please drop me a line uh, in the comments more than welcome and uh, don't forget to subscribe for more tutorials and Thank you.